Hello everyone. Hope you all are doing well. Today I am going to show you how to set up a knowledge articles. Okay. For example, how users can create a knowledge articles how, from the knowledge base. How the uh, knowledge users can create a knowledge articles from the knowledge bases. So let's see how we can set up it. Log in to your personal instance. Okay, or any customer instance or any other instance. Okay, go to the knowledge. For example, if any users want to create a knowledge uh, articles, okay, so they go from the knowledge basis, go to the knowledge basis, and they will go like snow docs. This is what we created before. And uh, if they want to create a knowledge base, knowledge articles inside that one. They will click on new. OK, let's cancel it. And uh, what is the category they can select? OK, like uh, um, like admin or support, we have two categories and uh, OK. OK, let me select category. Admin or if they want to create a new also, they can create a new. OK, if they don't want to create a new categories, how we can block it? OK, how we can block if they don't want to create? For example, if I want to create a subcategory, I can create and I can add it admin. OK, something like that. But if how we can block creating from uh, categories? OK, so if you open the knowledge base. OK, disable category editing. So this one, OK, we, if you if you don't want to allow users to create a new categories or edit categories, you can disable this one, OK, like that. OK, that is how you can uh, uh, you can uh, leave. OK, you can uh, stop OK. Creating the categories, let me select a category called admin. OK, and OK. OK, whatever the short description they will enter like test short, start, uh, short descriptions or something like that. And probably an article body they will paste it. Something like this. OK, uh, article type that depends upon which is HTML or wiki or anything. OK, uh, these are like uh, uh, read only workflow or source task from which okay attachment link if you want attachment link and you can add attachment link also to show okay display attachments also you can add it like to display attachments on the article okay or uh, before submitting uh, if you can search for duplicates if you have any duplicates on this uh, knowledge on these articles uh, you can see that uh, no results okay and uh, click on and uh, you can submit this uh, knowledge article. OK, you can submit the knowledge article and see a knowledge article is created and the workflow. So if you open again the same thing, the same thing, um, it is in draft. OK, so what uh, users will do, users will publish this one. OK, if they publish it, the article may be visible to unauthenticated users after it published. Do you still want yes? OK, so if I open this one. OK, this workflow is in review, so if you come here and it will go to the approvals. OK, approvals. Or managers and owner. Okay, anyone can approve it. Okay, let me approve it on behalf of them. Approved. Okay, approved. So what will happen? Uh, one approval is approved, and this one is published. Okay, this one is published, and you can see the published date is automatically populated. Okay, so now you can see the view article. See, this is how. The view articles is defined. Uh, the, this is how you, the view article is shown. Okay, 
So for example, if you don't want users to comment on this article and if you don't want to create helpful or uh, okay, if they don't want to uh, rate it or uh, okay, if they don't want to edit it. So how you what how you can do that is just um, um, in the knowledge articles itself, okay. If I configure, okay, you have options called uh, helpful count, knowledge base, rating, retired. See, disable commenting is there, okay? You can get it down. Disable suggesting, okay? and uh, so those two are there only disable commenting and disable suggesting okay let's save it okay cancel so while creating you can uh, comment on disable commenting or disable suggesting okay for example if i uh, go and uh, click on edit content okay and then if I click on like a uh, disabled suggesting and disabled commenting and save it, okay, and save it, okay, then again, a uh, view article, view article, then I don't have those things. But this helpful has or no on the rating, all these things will be, uh, will be done on, will be done on knowledge base side, okay, not on the article side. Okay, if you want to uh, disable uh, uh, rating, disa disable mark as helpful. So these two in knowledge base. Okay, so for all the articles, it will affect if you uh, click on disable rating or uh, disable mark as helpful. Okay, disable commenting. If you click here uh, on the knowledge base, it will disable for all the articles. But if you want only on individual articles, you need to go to individual articles and you need to click. OK, so that is how you can create the knowledge articles and approvals. Knowledge articles can be created from different sources. OK, if I go knowledge articles, OK, uh, I can create new. OK, leave it. Click on create new. OK click on which knowledge base now you need to select knowledge base okay all these things category everything so so in that way you can create a knowledge articles okay and you can publish it okay and the approvals if it is if you for the knowledge base if you have any approvals then approval needs to approve it okay yeah for example, I have created this knowledge. Uh, knowledge. Okay. If I want to retire, I will click on retire. Okay. If I want to update like test one, two, three, four. Okay. And then I, if I update and if I save it, okay, then it will update. So come down. Okay. Related articles. Feedback and uh, all these are there and add the versions also configure a letter list okay add versions Okay, here we don't have versions, I think. Okay, so uh, if I want to uh, retire this article, I will click retire and it will automatically retire it. Okay, do you want to replace the current article with other article? No, I don't want to replace, then retire. Okay, then go back. Okay, then go back and the workflow is set to retired. Okay, and the workflow is set to retired and you can republish it. 
okay if you want to republish you can republish the knowledge article has been published okay that's it so um, that is how you can create a knowledge articles and you can uh, create different different knowledge articles based upon the category or based upon the knowledge basis okay anything please do subscribe to get alerts for upcoming videos hope you will enjoy and learn service now thank you very much for your time